Hello everybody, it's Burns 40 What I have for you today is a 21 and 1 on Kowloon. Um, first I want to start off with, this is a little bit of a slow paced map. Uh, one of my least favorite maps in the whole game. Not even just in the DLC, but in the whole entire game. It's just too much of a maze. Too many ups and downs on it. So pretty much in this gameplay, I camp this building right here. It just seemed like the thing to do. I'm not going to run again this map. I don't like it. Too many open spaces. And I've noticed that there's been too many corner campers so far as you know. My plane of it. Uh, what is your guys' thoughts on the new DLC for PlayStation? How does everybody feel about that? I'm slightly let down by it. Um, map pack that they brought out for Modern Warfare 1 and 2. And it seemed like even at War at War were way better than this map pack. The uh, thing I have liked so far is the zip line on this, as well as the sentry guns on Berlin Wall. I do like that they brought in another element to the gameplay. I like to see them take a little bit further, maybe in the second DLC if they do come out with another one. Maybe to have some stationary weapons that you can hop on and control yourself, such as the sentry gun, maybe in a tower that you can control yourself. Like I said, this is a little bit more of a slow paced map. I'm sorry that I am camping on it, but this is one of the maps I really don't really like. Um, like I said, I do go 21 and 1 on this gameplay, so I did do pretty well. And I'm running the G11 with a variable zoom and a China Lake for my secondary with Hardline Pro. Uh, I'm going to say Slide Up Hand Pro and Hacker. Seems to be the classes I run in all my, or I'm sorry, the perks I run in all my classes. I'm um, not sure how that guy didn't see me in the window over there. Pretty thankful we got my Cobra out of that kill. Now I'm setting at 6 and 0. I have noticed that on this map, getting any kill streak reward is not really tough, but it's not very beneficial. Uh, chopper Gunner, as you see here, man, it's really hard to get people with as many buildings as there for them to hide in. Uh, a couple games before this, I did get dogs, and I was let down majorly. I I think I got maybe one or two kills the whole time the dogs were out. So, right now I've got my chopper gunner. Just waiting for my cobra to leave the map. And while I'm at it, just want to mention that I'm getting pretty excited about the new game Homefront coming out in a couple weeks. And I'm ready for a new challenge, a new game, a new setup. Seems like. Black Ops has got played out very fast, and it's not as fun as the previous Call of Duty series to have. I've only had this game for about two months, and I'm, I'm just, I will not say burnt out, but I'm just let down by it. There's not as much challenges or anything like that, so I've just gotten pretty bored with it very quickly. It's been pretty depressing for me. I've just been rolling with the same guys lately. Taking a couple friends here and there. I do like the way the match is at. That makes it a little bit more fun to get something different to play when you do get sick of Team Deathmatch or anything like that. Uh, I did get some gameplays recorded of my other teammates on the pro team, uh, Reggie and Reagan and Tricky Dick. I'll try to get those uploaded here shortly to get you on there. I don't know if they're wanting to do their own commentary or what they're wanting to do, but I will get those out there for you. Also, I'd like to thank my, my subscribers I have right now. Uh, Dirty Pickens is the Ragin Reagan, and then I've got a guy named Big Country 77. He's an old, old teammate of mine from Modern oh, Warfare like days. So I just want to give him a shout out. He's been giving me a few pointers here and there, so I try to get my commentaries and my gameplay a little bit more to what you guys are looking for. And he stepped up and gave me some advice, so I'm looking forward to that. And pointed me in the direction of Sony Vegas and this will be my first gameplay uploaded views in Sony Vegas. So anybody that has experience on Sony Vegas, please give me some information or some tips and pointers on that. Here we on the way. And also I'd like to ask again if anybody has any ideas of what they would like to see from my gameplay or my commentaries, please let me know. I'm open to many ideas. I'm pretty laid back guys, so whatever you mention, I'll try to bring it out there. If anything, subscribe and I'll give you a shout out. Right there, just got killed by a hacked sentry gun. I'm actually getting my rush where I just was, and the guy's in there trying to hack my sentry gun, so 
I take him out. We're close to victory, don't quit now. Still running the same kill streaks of care package, attack chopper, and chopper gunner. We're gonna run this for a little bit. I'm thinking on this map for now I'm gonna start running with the B-52, uh, with as many people being able to hide in buildings as possible. I think that'd be a good kill streak for this map. Keep them out of the way of the chopper gunner, maybe get them out in the open. Maybe start running a 7, 8, 9 type kill setting. Uh, right now, team's in a pretty big lead. You see that guy rush that building, expecting me to be in there, and luckily for me, and unfortunately for him, I wasn't. Also, any viewers, please subscribe to my channel. I am wanting to build my channel and get more pointers and more commentary. So that's my gameplay. Thanks for watching.